Tea. This is the Rumor Report with Angela Yee on The Breakfast Club. Well, Tamar and Vince were on The View and they addressed all the reports about their marital issues. Now, first off, Tamar talks about the fact that people thought that this was fake for ratings. Here's what she said. I wish mine wasn't real. You know, I wish I could say that a lot of times um, it's made up Mm -hmm. just so I can hide behind the truth sometimes. In this situation, I absolutely have no reason to lie about my marriage and the things that's happening in my marriage for ratings. I think that's disgusting and I would never sell my soul to the devil like that. It's not that serious. Now, do people like that owe it to, uh, you know, the public to talk about their marital issues? I think part of it is they have a reality show with the two of them together, and a lot of things ended up being very public. Yeah, so they so, owe it to the public, they think. I think so. I mean, it, their, their life has been so open, and their relationship has been so open when it was good. So when things turn, I think the public wants to know what's going on. And when mm. you have a reality show based on your relationship, it kind of makes it, like, more public. Absolutely. All right, well, here is what Tamar had to say about them discussing divorce. I have a regular marriage and, and things happen. In my marriage, you know, it, it was just to a point where I felt like divorce was the only option, although that we're in extensive counseling and, <laughs> and that is much yeah. needed and it still will always be. But I think the bigger oh. picture um, of everything is that we have a responsibility to my amazing four-year-old Sweet son time. and just to raise him in the most comfortable, amazing, loving, secure household that we yeah. can. That's why we don't live together. So are they together or not? I guess they're working on it. They're, they're working counseling. on it. Seems like they're separated. They're, they're, they're going through separation. But they're still but... trying to work on mending their relationship. Now, here's what Vince had to say about all of the rumors and the alleged woman who was pregnant. Absolutely not. And all the other allegations are just not true. I'm just not that kind of person. I love this lady with all my heart. I love my family with all yeah. my heart. And I will never stop fighting for my family and trying to make it be great. As he should. Well, you better be sure that the little baby not yours. Because if some little chubby well, he's little... he's saying he never even impregnated a woman. All right. Is when, what he's when saying. some little chubby little boy pops up who can't keep his mouth closed, we're going to know that's his son. <laughs> All right, now, Safari was trending this morning on Twitter, and I was like, what is going on? 120,000 tweets about Safari? Well, you know, I had to do some research, and turns out there was a penis picture that was leaked. Now, people are going crazy online. I'm reading some of the tweets from people. Uh, one person said, uh, at Partition Beat, no, I would have left Safari, too. I can barely afford health care now. I got to buy life insurance. Obese Marilee said, oh, I don't know, all of a sudden I think we need more music from Safari. Is he on tour? One person left a comment on his page. If you ever need someone to talk to, my mouth is always open for you. So I'm assuming he got a big penis. It's huge. And as a matter of fact, we asked some people <laughs> yeah, around this studio what they had to say. His penis is huge, isn't it? And it's the biggest half. And it's the biggest half. Biggest half. Biggest half. And it's the biggest half. I don't know who those people are. <laughs> I ain't seen no pictures, but I do stand on what I said. I said uh, a month. You could stand on it too. I said a, I said a few yeah. months ago. I said I said Safari is gonna get a hit record this year. Well, he might now because a lot of women are requesting music from Safari. Uh, I just I just I got a sneaky feeling that Safari gonna get a hit record this year, man. After seeing those news, one woman said, "Hey, my tax returns came in. What you need?" They're just going crazy over that. He actually show. sent me the first single. Oh, I Whoa. thought you were going to say the picture. No, no, no. I said wow. the first single. He said it to me the other day. I heard something else just yeah, now. I ain't going to lie to you. I heard, you what, I what, you I heard what I wanted to hear like everybody does no. in this era. <laughs> I heard you say that Safari sent you some penis pictures. No, I said Safari sent me a single, his first single. I th- listen, I think he's going to get a hit record this year. I said that last month. I think he's going to get a hit record this year. All right, G Herbo got arrested over the weekend. Now, he was arrested along with two others, and apparently they found... a. Uh, each person in possession of a loaded handgun. So he was arrested and charged with a felony count of aggravated unlawful use of a loaded weapon along with two of his friends, Giovante Royale Kimbali and Marcello Walton. The three of them are supposed to be in court today. So we will see what happens and keep you updated as well. He was riding around Chicago? Uh, Yes. Well, you know, Chicago, you either get caught with it or get caught without it. You'd rather get caught with it than get caught without it, right? All right, Candy Burris has put out a new song, and the song is called Fake People. Now, a lot of people have uh, been having some type of reaction about her not being on this escape tour, but she is making spot date pop-ups and everything. So here is a little snippet of the song so you can see what you think. I came with fake people Smile in my face, no doubt While you plotting on me If 
I'm the other members of Escape, I'm a little hot right now. Why? Because you got time to make your own music, but you don't want to make music with us. I was thinking to say the, hey, power, guess, the power play right now would be to do the Escape album. With well, all four she members. can't commit to going on tour. That's the whole problem because she has a Broadway play. But you'd go on tour with yourself. Even if you don't want to go on tour she right now. She doesn't have to go on tour get, for her album. Can we get in the studio and at least make some new music? Can we do a new Escape album? I'd much rather hear a new Escape album than uh, Candy solo music. All right. Don't like fake people? What are you talking about? The song. That's the name of the song. Well, I'm Angela Yee, and that's your rumor report. All right.